What's up? It's Coach Jones of ILB. I'm going to show you how to sauce up your crossovers. Let's check it out. All right, now look, I know everybody watching this can do a crossover, but I want to show you how to make these crossovers look phenomenal, all right? So instead of doing the basic crossover, I want to show you how to bake somebody, how to make them look silly for even trying to guard you, all right? So here's what I want to go over first. The basic footwork for a crossover. We want to step inside foot. Let's go right foot. We want to go for a left to right crossover. So we want to step right foot, left foot. We want to plant that left foot hard and cross over under our knee. If you cross over too high, defenders like me who are really short, who like to sit, that we call it sit, they like to have their hands down waiting on that crossover so they can pick your pocket. All right. So what you want to do is one, have great footwork, right, left, shift your shoulders outside your frame so you want to get it outside and really sell that crossover as if you were going to your left. All right, so I'm gonna go right foot, left foot, crossing over low under that hand that's already trying to rip the basketball. Okay, so let's practice that first going both ways. And a good drill you can do to practice that is to stay stationary. A lot of people like to do these moves on the move, but they can't do the move stationary, all right, standing still. So what you can do, you can get low in a great athletic stance, you can pound, cross, pound, cross, pound, cross. Once you get comfortable with it, you just snap it harder, lower, harder, Lower. All right, that's a good drill to work on that crossover. Once you get good doing it stationary, let's do it on the move. Okay, so let's go over that footwork one more time, left to right. We're gonna plant right left cross. All right, going back around, the ball's in our right hand, we're gonna plant left right cross. Left right cross. Right, and again, the ball itself is not the only thing that we're trying to use on this fake. We want to use our shoulders. I was playing against a, a college player when I was younger. He was a Division I basketball player. He told me, hey, once you go to another level, middle school, high school, college, you're going to have to really sell these fakes. That's the biggest difference between these levels is how well do you sell these fakes. Because those guys playing varsity right now, those guys playing college, they've seen a lot of crossovers before. What makes your crossover any different? Okay, so that's the footwork on the basic crossover. Now I want to show you a, a toss cross, all right? So the same footwork applies for the toss cross as you just saw on the basic crossover. So we want to go right, left on that crossover, but this time we're going to kind of hop into that crossover, all right? That little hop adds some more flair, just a little subtle difference between the footwork. Okay, so let's watch it. Here's the first one, the basic cross. Right, left, cross. You want to keep that ball tight, Right, left, cross. Got it? Now, on the toss cross, we're not going to cross under our knee. Instead, we're going to toss the ball over our waist and on the other side of our body. So let's watch it again. We're going right, left, tossing. That hand staying on top so we're not palming, we're not carrying it. Tossing over, boom, onto the other side. Okay, now let's add some flair, let's add some sauce to that. I want these steps to be exaggerated a little bit more. Okay, so I'm gonna, ooh, ooh. I'm gonna exaggerate those steps, which gives me a lot more steam going at my defender. So instead of the basic right left, let's hop into it. Ooh, hop, ooh. See that? One more time, one more time. Right left, toss cross. Coming down, right left, toss cross. Hey, you really wanna punch, plant, and explode off of that left foot. All right, that's what's going to give you the power to get past your defender. All right, so we're going again. Plant that left foot, push off, get past your defender. Again, you want to sell this move with your body, your eyes, everything. Okay, you even call for a screen sometimes. But hey, 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 come up, come up, close rock, screen, 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 boom. Right, let's work on that deception. Guards are really, the good guards are really deceptive on offense, on defense, all around the court, okay? So let's recap. Toss cross, right, left, boom, or left, right, depending on what side we're going. We're going right to left, we're going to go left, right, plant off that outside foot, throw that ball over, making sure that my hand is not under the basketball, it's on the side, on the top, all right? pushing it outside of my body, outside of my frame, and we're selling this move every single time that we use it. So the next crossover I wanna show you is the killer crossover. Now, AI is the guy who I think has patented this move, 
All right, so the killer crossover, we're a little more loose, we're a little more flexible, we're a little more, uh, we're stretching out on these crossovers, all right? It's a little more advanced than the other two that I just showed you. So let's do a crossover going left to right. Coming down, I wanna have the same footwork, right, left step, all right? I'm stepping right, left, I wanna exaggerate this left foot step going lateral, okay? So as I do this move, I'm gonna step out, get that basketball outside of my frame. So if you freeze frame it, it'll look just like this. Right, left, boom. All right, but except for this basketball, of course you don't wanna have this basketball under your hand, under the basketball, your hand under the basketball because it's gonna be a what? A palm carry, okay? So we're stepping right, left, stretching that basketball out, boom, and snatching it back, ripping it back. Okay, a strong rip too. So back to the same stationary dribble we worked on. Here's the way you can work on this drill. Pound, step, boom. We call this step a reactor step, all right? Because we're trying to cause a, you guessed it, a reaction, all right? Pound, reactor, cross. Pound, reactor, cross. Pound, reactor, cross. And do this until you can't get it wrong, all right? Once you do it stationary, now it's time to try to do this move on the move, okay? So if I'm coming down, I'm going left to right, punch, right, left, extend, and rip back. Got it? We're gonna punch, right, left, come back. Right, left, boom. Got it? Hey, this move, out of all the other moves I wanna show you, you wanna sell this one more than all the other moves. All right, this one's purposely trying to bake your defender. Think about Iverson's move on Michael Jordan. The only reason that he sold it, doing it twice, is because he really sold it, not with just the hands and his basketball, but with his shoulders, his chest, too. All right, so one more time. Going right, left, boom, cross. And that's the killer crossover for Iverson. Hey, these don't work if you don't work. They sleep, we grind. So I need you to like, comment, and subscribe to this channel so you can keep getting this content sent directly to you. Go to that gym. Coach Jones, I'll see you on the next video.